Those of you who can access through your technology the recording of today's khutbah, go back and single out the end of the khutbah for this dua. Memorize it, embrace it, supplicate with it, because it can be a key by the permission of Allah Taala for us to purify the filth that is found in our souls and to rid our hearts of the stains and the corruption that are the effects of our bad actions. That dua that he used to say was collected by Imam Muslim in his Sahih, authentic compilation of hadith. So it is an authentic narration. He used to say, Allahumma inni a'udhu bika min al-ajzi wal-kasad. Oh Allah, I ask you to give me refuge from laziness and inability. Al-ajz, from inability, from being incapable. And al-kasal, by choice, being lazy. Wal-jubni wal-bukhli. And from cowardice and from stinginess. وَالْحَرَمِ وَعَذَابِ الْقَبْرِ And from feeble old age, and from a punishment in the grave. That's the first part of the dua. And the dua has three parts. The second part is, Allahumma آتِ نَفْسِي تَقْوَاهَا O Allah, grant my soul its piety. وَزَكِّهَا and purify it. You are begging Allah for purification of your soul. Wazakiha and tahayru man zakkaha. You are the best to purify it. And ta wali yuha wa maulaha. You are its caretaker and the one responsible for it. Allahumma inni a'udhu bika. Again, in the third part, more seeking refuge. O oh Allah, I ask you to grant me refuge min ilmin la yanfa, from knowledge that does not produce any benefit, wa min qalbin la yakhsha, and from a heart that has no surrender, servitude, humility, submission to Allah, wa min nafsin la tashba, and from a soul that never attains any contentment. وَمِن دَعْوَةٍ لَا يُسْتَجَابُ لَهَا And I seek refuge with you from a supplication that goes unanswered. One more time, brothers in Iman, Allahumma inni a'udhu bika. Oh Allah, I ask you to give me refuge min al-ajzi wal-kasal from incapability and laziness. وَالْجُبْنِ وَالْبُخْلِ And from cowardice and stinginess وَالْهَرَمِ وَعَذَابِ الْقَبْرِ And from feeble old age and a punishment in the grave اللَّهُمَ آتِي نَفْسِ تَقْوَاهَا O oh Allah, give my soul its piety وَزَكِّحَا And purify it أَنْتَ خَيْرُ مَنْ زَكَاهَا You are the best to purify it أَنْتَ وَلِيُّهَا وَمَوْلَاهَا you are its caretaker and the one responsible for it. Allahumma inni a'udhu bika. O Allah, I ask you to give me refuge with you. Min ilmin la yanfa. From a knowledge that does not provide any benefit. Wa min qalbin la yakhsha. And from a heart that does not have any submissiveness. Wa min nafsin la tashba. And from a soul that does not attain any contentment or satisfaction, وَمِن دَعْوَةٍ لَا يُسْتَجَابُ لَهَا And I seek refuge with you from a supplication that goes unanswered. Imagine, Abdullah, if Allah were to grant you what you ask for at this time. Imagine being granted these matters. Supplications that are answered by Allah. Hearts that reflect and ponder and lead you to good action. Souls that are content, happy, fulfilled and satisfied with the obedience of Allah and with the provisions that He has given you. SubhanAllah, knowledge that when it comes to you is a source of joy and happiness, opening up ease and mercy for you in this life and the next life. We beg Allah Ta'ala that He grant us 
refuge with him from incapability, laziness, cowardice, stinginess, feeble old age, and punishment of the grave. We ask him to purify our souls as he is the best one to purify the souls. We ask him to grant us piety in our hearts. He is the one who takes care of our hearts and our souls. He is the caretaker of those matters. We ask Allah Ta'ala that He grant us knowledge that benefits and that He gives us refuge with Him from knowledge that doesn't benefit. We ask Him for hearts that are fearful and submissive. We beg Him for refuge with Him from hearts that have no submissiveness. We ask Him for souls that are content and satisfied. And we beg Him for refuge with Him from souls that reach no contentment. And we ask Him for supplications that are responded to. And we seek refuge with Him from being stranded in this life, having supplications that go unanswered.